Now, WYFF News for Today. Live, local, breaking news. When your live, local, breaking news continues, you may recognize these cousins from The Biggest Loser, how they're doing since the show. We have some very special guests in our For Your Health segment this morning. We're joined by Felipe and Sione from last season's Biggest Loser. Welcome, guys. Thank you. Why don't you tell everybody who you are, which one's which, so they know. <laughs> well, I'm Felipe Flaw. And I'm Sione. And you're cousins, right? Yeah. Yes. Okay. You were on the show last year. Lots of people enjoyed watching you. Tell me what you've been doing since the show ended. Well, since the show ended, we've been pretty much going on a a health and wellness uh, a tour put on by Dina Holistics and basically just going out teaching people about nutrition and exercise. Okay, that's what you're here for in Greenville today. Mm -hmm. Tell me where you're headed today in Greenville. We're actually going to the YMCA in uh, Anderson. We're going to be uh, touring with uh, Fitness Across America. Uh, it starts at 9 o'clock. It's a three-hour uh, fitness seminar boot camp. We're going to talk your ear off, kind of try to motivate you a little <laughs> bit, but then also put you through a workout. Please. Stick Ooh. around. We'll be right back. We're back with more from Biggest Loser contestants, Cousin Sione and Felipe. Thank you guys for being here again. You're welcome. Thank you. All right, you guys have done a great job. I have to ask, when you started the show, what weights were you both starting at? I started at three, 372 pounds. 364. And where are you today? 341. I'm in the 340s too. 240s. Whoa. Oh, sorry. Oh, whoa. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I didn't catch it either. It's okay. Have you had your coffee? Yeah, we've only lost 10 pounds. <laughs> okay, this right here. Everybody knows what this is. I'm yeah. guilty of drinking a lot of it. <laughs> you guys said on the show that you really consumed a lot of beverages like this. Ooh. A lot of empty oh. calories. Why is this so bad? <clears throat> well, you know, I, I have to speak because uh, we always joke <laughs> about this. Uh, before the show, I don't even think I drank water for like a full year. I mean, I always thought like, oh, okay, this is liquid. You know, it's got some water in it. It's going <laughs> to hydrate me. But really, I, it's just, it's crazy how... We just don't know. We, we don't even figure it out either. Like going, getting on the show is a big wake up call. And I know there's a lot of people out there who just go day to day, just getting up and like me, like, oh, it's, it's liquid. It's going to hydrate me. But, you know, there's so many things uh, like on the show, we, we, we were taught to always read what's in the nutrition, uh, nutritional facts. I mean, calories, sugar, you know, sugar sometimes is not always bad for you. You know, and that's why we wanted to go on this, uh, talking about artificial sweeteners, high fructose syrup. Uh, there's better options out there. Right, Felipe, he brought it mm -hmm. up, but tell us, you guys are working, you guys are sponsoring yeah. this, right? Yes. This is a, a company called Medina Holistics. Um, basically, the former owner of Sobe came up with a drink that's lower calorie, um, no artificial sweeteners in it, uh, cane sugar. I mean, everything is organic, and the great thing, it's great tasting, and it's about 90 calories per bottle. Which, which which is great. We're looking at a, let's see, 140 in one of these. So that's exactly. a huge difference. And you said it tastes good. It tastes good. It's not a recovery drink, but it's a good health drink. And there's different flavors that you can find at your local Whole Foods. All right. Let me ask you. Holidays are coming up. Thanksgiving, Christmas. Oh. Uh -huh. Hard time for you guys, for everybody. What are some tips or some things we can do to not pack the pounds on this season? There's, there's a bunch of tips we've learned, um, you know, from Bob, from the show. Um, he had told us, you know, you don't have to restrict yourself to, you know, go to a party or go to a family gathering. And you don't have to say, no, I'm not going to eat anything. But, you know, it's all about portion control. And the one trick that he's told us is, you know, eat something before. Eat a big salad, eat a lot of greens. You know, a lot of times we don't, well, a lot of times we don't have time. So if you are gonna go to those parties hungry, you know, go ahead and eat as much vegetables, get your greens in before so that you get full. Another, another tip is if you're gonna go out and eat, some families go out to restaurants, um, make sure you order half of your food to go on a to-go plate. That way you're not tempted to eat the whole plate. And cutting it in half from cut, the start. Yeah, so there's, half that's in. a good idea. Well, you know, and you know, it's crazy as well. A lot of people don't know that when you go out to eat, a lot of us three, most of the time it's three to four servings a plate. So, I mean, you're cutting your portions right there. Mm -hmm. And then I guess, too, an obvious thing would be not to slack off on the exercise, which we tend to say, oh, yeah. it's a treat to myself, no exercise right, right now. Take some turkey bowl. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and you know, just just uh, know where you're going to be after the holidays. And we all know those, that guilt that, oh, my gosh, now i got to get started again. And you know what? Just don't get in that rut. Mm -hmm. All right, guys, thank you so much for being here. Oh, thank you. If you would like to catch more of these guys from The Biggest Loser and hear how you can succeed in weight loss, check out the Fitness Across America Boot Camp at the Anderson YMCA today, starting at 9 o'clock this morning. The YMCA is on East Reed Road in Anderson.